So it's January 31st and today marks the second anniversary of our Preventing Exclusions Fund, which is a fund that we launched in partnership with Sky, all focused on tackling the school exclusions challenge. We know that in recent years, school exclusions have exploded across the country. Too many young people are being suspended and are leaving our classrooms. And it's particularly vulnerable young people, young people from Gypsy Roma or Black Caribbean backgrounds, young people from poorer backgrounds, young people with experience of care who are most likely to be excluded and then to suffer the impact of that, whether that's in terms of their future employment, the GCSE results that they get, their mental health and a wide range of other challenges. I feel very fortunate to be here at Co-op Academy Leeds, which is one of the uh, partners as part of the fund. We've been investing in five organisations to try and address the school exclusions challenge and learn what works and spread that learning. And I've had the opportunity to meet with some brilliant community liaison officers who are working directly with the Gypsy Roma community and with teachers within this school to ensure that more Roma kids are staying here learning and fulfilling their potential. I'm also delighted to be able to uh, announce two new partners to the Preventing Exclusions Fund, Cape Mentors and Milk Honey Bees, both doing brilliant work supporting vulnerable young people. Uh, and you'll see more of us uh, working with the organisations, working with our brilliant founder, working with Sky to get the issue of school exclusions on the political agenda, to raise awareness about what's causing school exclusions, but critically what more we can all do to prevent school exclusions too.